Alpha Chips. Drunken Pete reporting five. Yes, I know I have toilet paper on my chin. I cut myself shaving this morning, and the smallest cut in the world is never going to stop bleeding. I'm, it's going to kill me. I'm going to die. I'm going to bleed out all day. Anyways, so today I did something I wanted to do for a very long time, which was make octopus. And so I, I, I went and I, I bought an octopus, a frozen octopus. Now, this is important about cooking octopus. You want to buy a frozen one because it's cleaned. And trust me, cleaning an octopus is its not fun. I watched many videos on YouTube about cooking octopus and whatever. So I made a Greek salad at my parents' house. And uh, so this was the frozen octopus that I bought. It was like $9.00. That's it, and uh, whatever. You're gonna see how much I got in that package for nine dollars, and what happened. And here it is. I cooked an octopus salad, possibly Greek style. Nobody knows. Enjoy. Bye. I'll be back at the end to eat it. I haven't tried it yet. Oh god. Okay, I don't know how this looks. Okay, what's up, guys? I'm at my parents' house. It's the only place to do this. It's uh, it's time to cook octopus, and I have a bandaid on my chin because I cut myself shaving, and it just refuses to ever stop bleeding. Okay, that, that's it. I'm going to show you the ingredients right now and uh, what, everything you need to, to cook a what's it, Greek style octopus salad. Oh, very excited. This is going to be a big mess and I'm going to have to clean myself. Let's begin. Okay, so here's the octopus as you can see. Now I thought it would be a whole octopus, but it's, it's just pieces of tentacle and I've been rinsing it and I'm not going to lie, it smells a bit. It smells fishy, but you know. That's what fish smells like, and it won't smell like that once it's cooked. And it looks very good. And uh, we're going to get ready to uh, boil it now. First, we're going to prepare the water like I saw on the internet, on a YouTube video. So basically, this is the water. And I'm going to wait till it starts boiling, but you're supposed to put in some peppercorns. I don't know what the heck that's supposed to do. And some bay leaves, so you go in. And salt, which I have the world's oldest salt shaker. I don't know why. Every salt shaker in my parents' house seems to be broken because they're all electric. And I don't know much of salt to put in, but I'm going to say that that is enough. What is this? Anyways, so I'm going to let that kind of boil because on the internet and in some of the YouTube videos, you have to like put the tentacles in, dip them in, and pull them out, and, and that's what's going to happen. So let's wait for that to boil. And that's it. Okay, so I'm gonna say the water is pretty much boiling at this point. So we're gonna add the octopus now. Now there's a technique that I learned on the internet on how to do this. So I'm going to try and do it the best I can, which is you dip it in like this and you hold it there for a couple of seconds and you pull it out and you see they're, they're curled up. And this is good. This is to do something with the tendons or whatever. Anyways, uh, yeah, you do it a couple more times. For a couple of s- Ow, it's hot! Okay, 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 okay. And again, more curling. And it's cooling off the water at this point, but that's okay. And that's it. A couple of times, and it's supposed to do something to make it more tender. So that's one. There's a few more. Um, God, they're long. I'm hold it in there for a couple of seconds. Fuck, my hand! Why? What am I using? Where's a glove? Why? Doesn't. And you take it out. You put it back in for a couple of seconds. You pull it out. Put it back in. Pull it out. See, they're turning there. They're curling up. Okay, that's good. Okay, one more. I thought it was a whole octopus. Like there was going to be a head and everything, but there's not. And that's it. That's it. It's done. The end. So now I'm going to leave that boil. I'm going to turn it down to simmer for like half an hour covered, apparently covered. And that's it. That's what's going to happen now. Now I'm going to go cut up all the other ingredients to uh, make this salad. And go. So basically, this is the ingredients you're going to need for this recipe. You're going to need um, peppercorns, a red onion, fresh bay leaves, and oregano, 
uh, olive oil, no, that's uh, red wine vinegar, olive oil, and I'm adding garlic. They didn't, they didn't say garlic, and regular vinegar. So that's what you basically need. And uh, I think that's a pretty good setup. And go. <laughs> Octopus is boiled with the bay leaves and I guess there's peppercorns in there somewhere. Anyways, it looks good. You can tell if it's good by poking it with the stick and it, see it picks it right up so it's not hard and it's going to be really tender. So let's make the salad immediately. I put some cold water on it. I don't even know if that was necessary. Okay, continue. Okay, so as you can see, I cut up the octopus into bite-sized pieces and it, it was, it was, it looks good. It's, it's tender. I think it's going to be good. So let's just start putting in some of our other ingredients. This is minced garlic. I'm going to put a bunch of that in. We do like garlic, so... Okay, there. That's, that's it. Just perfect, perfect. Um, this is red wine vinegar. Go ahead and put that in there. I guess that's enough. We're going to put in our fresh oregano. Okay, that's enough and onions. Okay, perfect. Now, just mix that up all together. And that's, that's pretty much it. That is octopus salad, Greek style, I guess, whatever. Nobody knows. Shut up, bowl. It's, it's a Pyrex bowl. My God. All right, so that's it. And uh, I'm going to put this in the fridge for a while. And I'm going to eat it tonight, and I'm going to tell you how it is. That's it. So that's basically what I did today. And here is the octopus salad, as you can see. And I, I had it in the fridge for like 10 minutes, and I'm so excited to try some. I want like the ultimate piece, though. Oh, God, shut it. I, I'm choosing. I choose you. I choose you. Oh. It's good. not chewy. That's good. Mmm. It's very good. It's very vinegary, but it's good. Well worth $9. All right. Mm, pretty good. It's very good. All right, well, this video of octopus salad is awesome if you make it like that. The garlic really helps. This is a new mini honey jack bottles. Also very good. I should pour some in. Okay, shut up. I go out. This video of eating on camera, eating octopus that I made today, which is super fun and awesome and a big mess, goes out. Bye!